Peabody Award goes to a new portrayal of Anne Frank's life in the midst of the Holocaust, which reminds us again of those whose sacrifices must never be forgotten. <laughs> Did you say goodbye to your father, your brother? You won't see them again, you know. They're already in the gas chambers. Don't listen to her, huh? Shut up, you. Hans Propey, the executive producer for Anne Frank, is here to accept the Peabody. Thank you. Uh, for many of us involved in putting together the Anne Frank miniseries at the Peabody Award honors, it was not a labor of love, but a labor of necessity. The burden of history made it necessary to get it right. It was important for us to tell the whole story, not to fade out discreetly at the familiar ending with the arrest in the annex, but to follow their descent to the man-made hell of Auschwitz, Birkenau, and Birkenbelsen. Quinn Taylor and Susan Lyon of ABC were in the forefront of that necessity to get it right, guiding and protecting the project throughout its evolution. It was also a burden of necessity that I personally get it right. <clears throat> I was born in Germany in 1943, and like all German children born in, in <clears throat> that era, the certification of my birth was stamped with a swastika by the German state. Over 300 people had a direct hand in creating the Anne Frank at the Peabody Honors. I thank you on their behalf. <laughs> 